Hello everyone, my name is Oliver from Lux Trading, and you may have noticed the collapse of a prop firm called Funding Talent. So let's talk about what it means in general for the future of prop trading firms. The collapse started when the company began sending out emails that the company has experienced difficulties that are often felt during hyper growth periods and that had carried them away from the original mission. Then they went on to say that funding talent isn't and has never been a broker and that there is actually no life capital given to the traders and that they do not benefit from any of the simulated trades taken on demo accounts. At last they have agreed that the funding service which they sold to their clients was basically just a game. The profitable traders on that program were then stopped from withdrawing from their accounts. And soon after that, the firm stopped all of their operations. So how did this happen and what should we learn from this? The simple answer is that the business model that they operated was not sustainable. The business model was that of a pyramid scheme. A pyramid scheme is a business structure which basically pays out old members with the money from the new members. Each of the members usually pays some sort of an entrance fee or or they make an investment, which is used to pay people in the level above them. Pyramid schemes are widely considered to be illegal because their product is not as important as the recruiting itself. And eventually you're gonna run out of the new people and you can't fill your obligations to the people who are newer. So eventually the game collapses on itself and the company is left without a way to pay everybody out. This is not the first time that this has happened and it's still happening now. The last Last few years have seen a ridiculous amount of prop firms who are popping the left, right, and center, offering you incredible profit splits and a chance to trade over six figures on their accounts, which majority of them are set up as a pyramid scheme. And all of that is apparently achievable if you just pass their challenge. So if all of that is true, how can these companies possibly make money? Well, most of these companies are built on the same principle. So let's just use FTMO as the most well-known and an example. They offer their traders up to a 90% profit share, which means that FTMO would keep 10% of all of the profits that the traders make. But people that use FTMO usually know that it's also demo accounts, very much like those of funding talent, and they're not actually trading with real capital. But most people don't care. So how are they making their money? They claim that they copy trades of the winning traders to the markets, but as a senior member from FTMO kindly stated in an interview, the success rate is only 8%. So again, how are they making any money off of that? Because only if 8% are actually passing the first stage, that doesn't even mean that they're making money. That just means that they're passing the first stage and FTMO only gets to keep 10% of that. That can't be enough. As I've mentioned a bit earlier in this video, there's one thing that these companies have in common. In all of them, you have to pay an upfront fee. And that is where the real pyramid scheme begins. What they're essentially offering you is an investment opportunity, but in the form of a challenge that you take. So let's take FTMO for an example again. They're offering you a thousand euro investment opportunity for essentially what is $200,000 in return for you to trade with. The marketing schemes that they use are very similar as well. For example, their FTMO leaderboard only shows the top three traders that got highest payouts this month and not the rest of 92% traders who have lost their money. At the end of the day, it's pretty obvious what is happening here. The winning couple percent who make money are being paid out by the fees from the losing 92%. All of this is not sustainable for a long term because a pyramid scheme can only continue as long as there are new people, new fees coming in. So if traders stop purchasing accounts, or if the winning traders have an extremely good month and a lot of people make money at once, it will all collapse as there will most likely not be enough money in the bank to pay out everybody. As we talked about them earlier, funding talent was a big name in the industry. So it is not a question of if it will happen, but when. And we have already seen firms like funding talent and others in the process. But after listening to this, you may be wondering, okay, how are you guys different from anybody else? Aren't you just the same pyramid scheme prop firm? Well, let me answer that. First of all, we only and exclusively offer accounts with real money. So when we say that we're giving you $10,000 to trade on your first live account in stage two, that is real money coming either from us or from our investors. So if traders lose money on this account, we lose money and we can't profit. Second, 
While our program has a fee to start, this fee is not used to pay out winning traders. The fee covers use of all our software, such as MT4, TradingView, and Trade Revolution platforms, the Trader Dashboard, the account analysis performed by a professional risk desk, and all the other maintenance and salaries that need to go on in running a prop firm. Our capacities and resources are unfortunately limited. And as our program has high daily operational costs, we simply cannot offer this opportunity for free. We would if we could. Also, we return the fee to the traders who actually managed to pass the first stage as a sort of a sign of good faith. Unlike other firms who pay it back after two or three stages as a part of your profits. Third, we provide a highly experienced risk desk to our traders. Not losing money is our priority. We're not looking for traders who can make 10% a month. We want consistent month-to-month -month profits. After all, this this is a trading program, not a casino. Therefore, we have gathered a team of experts in the industry, which throughout your stages will be making sure that you adhere to good risk management rules. Number four, we don't have any time limit in any of our stages. We don't want to rush or force traders to trade at a high risk, as it goes against everything I've just said. Instead, we prefer traders to use their own trading style and slowly develop their account and strategy throughout the stages of our program. And last but not least, the elite trading. Traders Club. We have prepared the Elite Traders Club for a single purpose, to educate and help traders to develop to a point where trading can become their full-time career. To achieve that, we have employed experienced traders as mentors, we have set up a daily live trading room to help you analyze the markets, and we have even acquired a Trading Central software which is not generally available to the public, and many more features and benefits just to help our traders succeed. This is how we differ from other prop firms, we're the only one to offer this. We are the only prop firm which is on your side. And that would be all from me for today. If you liked the video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And if you want to learn more about Lux, feel free to reach out to us on our 24-7 live chat or send us an email at info at My name has been Oliver. Thank you for watching and have a great one.